Hey guys, what's up? It's Monica and welcome to another outfit of the day, Everyday Style with me. If you are not familiar with this series, basically I share my everyday looks, what I wear to work, to travel, what I wear on vacation, what I wear as a mom, basically what I wear every day as a fashion and lifestyle content creator. So a lot of really fun, realistic, easy to wear, comfortable outfits that are always elevated. So if that sounds like a vibe to you, just keep on watching. Um, also, if you are new and you're not familiar with this series or you're just not familiar with me, in general like I said I'm Moni I am a fashion lifestyle content creator and I love to share my style inspo and tips with you guys so make sure you just go ahead and subscribe because we're a vibe we like to have fun so welcome um anywho let me get into the video because we've got a lot of really great outfits um I have some looks from my Mexico trip if you guys have not watched the Mexico vlog make sure you watch it it's um, it was amazing literally it was amazing like amazing anyway make sure you watch the mexico vlog so we got some looks from mexico i was in houston for a few days with some looks from there i did a day trip to new york we've got i think maybe just the travel look because it literally was just a day um a day trip um and then just looks from working from home the weather is a little up and down right now in atlanta so some of them are kind of like you know on the warmer side ish and then some are a little bit more for cooler weather so there's a good variety of outfits so make sure you guys watch everything to the end and don't forget to let me know which outfit is your favorite go ahead and just like the video because i can just tell you it's a good one so just like it anywho let's get into the video because like i said it's really good let's get into it Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. I'm getting ready to meet up with a friend, but I also have to get some work done. Um, it's definitely getting cooler in Atlanta now, so brought out the cashmere, wearing this beautiful cashmere sweater and matching cardigan from Jay McLaughlin. My shorts are from Saint Saint Um I. I don't think I share, I, I wore them during fashion week, but I don't think I shared them in an outfit of the day. I really wanted to create a fun little pink monochromatic look that looked fun and dressed up. So that's what I did with this. I'm obsessed with this outfit. My choker is Saint Laurent. We're doing the little Fendachi. And really it's not, I'm not wearing it for function. I'm just wearing it for fashion and just kind of like an accessory to my outfit. My boots are... Jimmy Choo. Wish me luck on these. I'm wearing them for the full day. I have thick socks with, um, I'm wearing thick socks with them so my feet don't slide and I'll just, you know, take it easy in terms of the steps. But they're not bad for the most part because you have that wedge heel. Um, and because I've got the thicker socks, I don't feel like my feet are pushing through so that's great. Uh, what else do we need? I'm going to share the fragrance that I'm wearing today. It's absolutely beautiful. It, it kind of really goes with this pretty vibe that I have going on. I wanted to take this these classic pieces because you've got your tweed, you've got your cashmere, and I really wanted to give it more of a modern touch. Um, and I feel like the boots are definitely giving it a modern touch. The chokers adding to that, the bag, and the fragrance is definitely feeling my vibe. This is Flower Bomb. Um, this was gifted to me a while ago. I'm sure I shared it in a vlog, but I love it. I love this scent. It's really pretty and florally. Um, so I just need sunglasses and a bag and then I'm out of here. Sunglasses. We're going to do these glasses from Milaner. I'm obsessed with them. They really go very well with the look. They're definitely giving me almost like that, um, 1940s, 1950s vibe with a, with a silhouette and then with the tweed and the cardigan. Love that. And because I've got to, you know, bring my laptop with me and get some work done, I'm just going to have this, my um, Dior book tip with me. Like I said in my previous um, video about how to style colorful bags for fall, I'm really trying to carry the bags that I probably wouldn't have carried otherwise. Um, and this is definitely one of my summer bags that I'm obsessed with, but I'm trying my best to make sure I carry it through the fall. So I'll probably just carry it like this on my arm and not carry it as a top handle, but just carry it on my arm. And this is the look. Outfit of the day. Love it.
this is kind of like a little bonus for this look. Oh my god, while I turn off this TV. Okay, so went, did my errands, but now I'm still at home and I really want it to be a bit more comfortable. I'm not gonna go pick up my kids with the boots and everything. So I decided to wear my Jordans with it and switch up the bag. Actually, let me wear this properly. So I have my little Balenciaga, which I will wear has a crossbody. Everything else is the same. I just switched out the shoes and it's cute. I love this. I love this. Um, yeah, I really like these. I feel like I need another pair of Jordans. But anywho, this is kind of just like a little bonus look just in case, you know, it doesn't have to be like rigid or dressy. You could still, you know, make an outfit like this casual. Um, yeah, and this is what it looks like. Um, sunglasses. One moment. These will be my sunglasses of choice since I just am obsessed with them and I seem to wear them everywhere. So now this is another little bonus to this pink look. Love it. Let me know which one do you guys prefer? Like, what would you rock? Would you do both? And, you know, if you were going, you know, to run errands, pick up kids, maybe go to the mall, wear this, or you would just wear the other one the whole day. <laughs> Let me know with your comments below. Okay, on to the next look. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day in Mexico. Actually, this might be in another vlog completely, so welcome to my Mexico outfit of the night. I'm going to dinner real quick, um, wearing this set from Lulu's. I love it. You guys probably saw this in an outfit haul that I did. This shirt is from J. Crew. absolutely fabulous. The pants are amazing. Then we've got the Hermes Oran slides. Valentino little um, Roman studs and my Dior sunnies. Of course, I will link everything. I'm running late for dinner, so this is really quick, but just wanted to serve some style inspo. Even though this would have been a day look, I figured I'd dress it up with the shirt. So that's a fun way to dress up what could have been a day piece or day set um, and give it an evening dinner look. Outfit of the night. All right, today's outfit of the day, the last day in Mexico. I'm wearing this GSTQ tank top. My glasses are Dior. My pants are Frankie Shop. And I'm wearing Cita's um, Hermes slides because my shoes are packed and then I'm wearing my sneakers to travel, but we're gonna go get breakfast real quick. And then after breakfast, I will share the full travel look with you guys. But I thought this was really cute with the slides. And even though these pants are technically a fall pant, because they're a little heavier, but they still work and they're pretty breathable. So I just wanted to share this part of the look first and then I'll share the full look afterwards. Anywhere you go, anywhere you go, give it all. All right, guys, so just got back from my lunch or breakfast rather, and here is the final look, my travel look. Um, these same accessories, really, the pants are... Um, Frankie Shop, GSTQ top. And then I added this sweater from No Jeans and I love it. It's really fun. Um, it's just a really fun top, like a, a really fun cardigan rather. And then I'm wearing my Air Jordans. They're super comfortable and they look really good with the pants. We've got on my Chanel 19. You guys know it, that's what I travel with. And yeah, and I'll probably just have the sweater down a little bit because it's hot and it just looks a little bit more stylish that way. I also added my, um, Chanel AirPod case holder. I normally wouldn't wear it with a top like this that has ruching detail, but um, because I'm traveling and I don't want to lose my AirPods, I will wear them this way. And no makeup for me today. I feel like I did makeup like back to back to back, so I'm very happy to have a no makeup day. Got my luggage there, the same like trusty book tote. I have the Hermes scarf and then my Rome luggage. But yes, this is the look. This is my travel back to Atlanta outfit of the day. I heard it's getting cooler, so this is perfect. But yes, outfit of the day. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. So today is it's Sunday, it's the weekend, so I'm just going to pick up something I ordered online for in-store pickup and then just take the kids for just some, you know, 
window shopping, so my outfit is very casual cool. It kind of reflects that. It is somewhat cold-ish in Atlanta, but it's not super cold yet. So I'm wearing this lightweight cashmere sweater from Jay McLaughlin. My shorts are from Express. These are pieces that you guys have seen, would have seen in previous hauls or outfit of the day videos. Um, actually, maybe not this one in outfit of the day, but very happy I'm getting to wear it now. My glasses are new. They're Loewe. I love them. You guys know I have the yellow pair. Rock them during um, New York Fashion Week. They tend to sell out really quickly. So while I was trying to link for my New York Fashion Week vlog, I found them in blue. So of course I scooped them up immediately because I love them. And they look great with this look. Um, my bag is my Dior Bobby. Love this bag. I was going to sell it at one point. I'm kind of happy I did it because it's just a great, casual, cool bag. And it looks great with this outfit. The shoes are my Chanel Dad sandals. I know these sandals are not necessarily everyone's cup of tea. I personally love them. I feel like it, they do a great job of elevating the outfit. Shoes tend to really you know, push your outfit in whichever direction you want it to go. So for this, because everything is very casual, mind you, the, the cashmere is a classic cashmere and the silhouette is more of a straighter silhouette. Um, but I did a half tuck because it's a little bit more straight and my body silhouette is straight. So I did a little bit of a half tuck to kind of, you know, make my waist look a little bit more narrow um, and not straight per se. So that kind of works if you have that similar body frame. And you can do that even if your body frame is not straight athletic, which I've shared with you guys. Um, but yes, love the shoes with the look, love the bag with the look. I'm just doing one watch today, keeping it simple um, with my Michelle, keeping it simple with my Michelle um, diamond, gold and silver watch. Then we've got a Lagos ring here. You guys have seen that many times, Cartier, Cartier. And yeah, this is the look. I'm probably gonna keep the glasses on for this whole trip because I have absolutely no makeup. I'd even do my eyebrows and I'm just not in the mood. I, I feel like I did so much makeup while I was in Mexico that I really just wanted to give my face a complete break. And of course I start shooting again next week. So I will, or well, within to the new week. So I'll start using makeup again. But anywho, this is my look. Today's outfit of the day, casual, cool um, perfume. I'll share which perfume I did. I'm used real quick. So I used the Lancome El Bell. I think it's called, I can't remember the name real quick. Um, Le El Bell, yes. And it's an amazing fra um, fragrance. I love that. Um, yeah, I partnered with Lancome and they get, gifted me this bottle as part of the collaboration. Funny enough, they just sent, so yeah, La Vie El Bell, La Vie Est Bell. Hmm. Maybe it's different. I don't know. But this one is going to be part of a giveaway. So if you guys are not subscribed to my um, website, make sure you subscribe to them giving that away but love that scent anywho so that's the full look today's look casual cool i have guests coming over as well i just wanted to be comfortable today and obviously put together so outfit of the day to another day another outfit so I'm getting ready to leave the house real quick but I really liked my outfit so I wanted to share it with you guys um, I did shoot earlier hence I've got a little bit of makeup on still got my equipment there um, but this outfit features old pieces and something new which I'm obsessed with um, so yes let's first of all get into this um, tank of uh, a tank top it's a turtleneck, but it's a bodysuit. It's from Wolford. It's a little bit on the pricier side for a bodysuit, but I love it. I've had it for years now, and it's just one of those pieces that I'm obsessed with. Whenever I put it on, I feel very sexy. Love this nude brownish color. It also comes in black and white. Of course, I will link it. And if I can find a less expensive option, I will link that as well. These jeans are old. They are a goldie. I haven't worn them in a minute. And, you know, I was doing a video for closet must-haves which forced me to go into my closet to search for stuff and I saw these and I'm like I did not wear them all summer so I purposely brought them out and I'm obsessed with them the thing about this particular silhouette which kind of balloons at the side a little bit fitted and high-rise on the top the hem is probably right to past my ankle 
However, when you're wearing it with loafers, it looks off. So you got to roll them up or else you'll look short and stumpy. So I wanted to wear them with these loafers. They are new from J. Crew. I'm obsessed with them. They're chocolate, nice chunky sole, beautiful shoes. So for sunglasses, these are kind of new-ish. I got them for Fashion Week. They're Prada. You've got the blue on the uh, the blue in the front and purple on the side, which pairs perfectly with my Dior book tote in this um, zodiac print. I just did a video about how you know we need to wear our summer. Um, bags in the fall winter colorful ones and I did this video intentionally because I know when the seasons change I tend not to pick up my bright bags and I am sure I'm not the only one so I decided that I was going to create outfits around my colorful bags which is mo motivation for me to bring them out so bringing this one out I bought it during the summer it's got all these beautiful colors in them um, but you know what I'm going to definitely wear this all year round like why not? And make sure you guys check out that video. It should be out by the time this comes out. And I really just share the different ways to wear your colorful bags in the fall. So it's kind of like a lookbook style inspo. And I hope you guys love it. So, of course, I will link it in the description box and check it out. But, yes, back to this outfit. We've got the jeans. We've got the bag, the chunky loafers. They're super comfortable. I think they also come in black. Um, yeah, and this is my look. I took all my arm candy off because I wanted... The sleeves nice and long. I just have a whole bunch of different rings, which are usual suspects. And of course, I link all the jewelry as well in case you're interested. But yes, this is my look. I got to go because I got to pick up my daughter and then just keep on working for the day. But outfit of the day. We love, we love, we love. to another day another outfit um, today's look is very casual cool I'm actually traveling I'm heading out now so this is my travel look um, I'm going to Houston it's just a, it's a short trip with the family so I'll bring you guys along vlog wise but um, under my blazer I'm just wearing this a goldie um, bodysuit it's comfortable it's still very hot in Houston so I wanted to dress accordingly, but of course we're going to be on the plane. So this blazer is oversized. It's old from um, Shop Up. I got it from Shop Up. Cannot remember the name of the brand, but I know it sold out a long time ago. Um, OG subscribers for the last year and a half, you've seen this. I love this blazer. Um, wearing my trusty MM6 jeans. I love them. They're super comfortable. Brought out the Air Jordans today. There's some lilac on it, so it matches perfectly with the blazer, wearing my Chanel 19 earpod case holder, carrying my Chanel 19 for bag of choice, took the braids out, did my hair and added the ponytail thingy to it. I hope I did it good. I literally just did it like in 10 minutes. So, but I wanted, you know, something a little bit fun, the long hair. So we're doing that. I'm just going to probably let it hang in the back. Um, and then my suitcase is already in the car. Always traveling with my Dior book tote and Hermes scarf sunglasses one moment I will be wearing these bad boys I love these Dior sunnies they are everything and they look great with my hair slicked back and then perfume I'll show you what perfume I wore I also did Dior so we did that for the scent of the day to travel and this is my travel outfit of the day I love this look I love the pop of purple um, the kids are traveling with me too let me see if I can find them for their outfit of the day. They might be in the car right. Anywho, outfit of the day, time to go. Bye guys. Hey guys, welcome to another outfit. I am in Houston for a family, a very short family, um, um, kind of going to an event basically. So. Going to a birthday party. This is my outfit of the night. Ignore the mess in the background. I'm wearing this gown dress from 
Veronica Beard. The brand gifted it to me. I wore it for my birthday, but I don't think I shared it. So I figured, and I wore it at home because I didn't go anywhere for my birthday, but I wanted to put on a fabulous dress. So now I'm actually wearing it out. So it's a beautiful gown. I felt like I didn't need much. So I'm just doing my Valentino cuff, keeping my earrings simple. I hope you guys can see the makeup. Got a little bit of makeup on tonight. Um, did some powder. Then the dress is nice and long, so I'm wearing my Valentino tangos. I didn't bring the wrong right bag because I literally just did carry on. And for some, I don't know why. Now in high, oh yes, I'm shooting something and I figured this would be a good bag for it. So I figured, you know what? We're just going to do the black. Normally I would not do black with a beautiful peach color and then um, beige shoes. I would have probably done my called Gaia clutch, but I didn't bring it because my suitcase was full. So we're doing the little Gucci tonight and got the long ponytail. And this is my look outfit of the night. If it's still available, of course, I will link it. It just fits so well. And I didn't have to iron it, so that was a plus. Outfit of the night. Welcome to another day, another outfit. I have to record this on my cell phone because, oh God, the sound of the fan. I'm sorry, I apologize in advance. <laughs> on my cell phone because my um, vlogging camera is packed and ready to go. And the something is full, something's wrong with it. Anywho, quick outfit of the day, traveling, going back home to Atlanta from Houston, wearing Reebok t-shirt, Reebok um, pants and sneakers. I'm doing a collaboration with DSW and Reebok, so I, this is part of what I shot. Actually, it's not this exact look, but something different. But I decided I'll wear it on the plane. It's really cool. It's got a little purple or writing detail in the back, and I, I have my purple blazer as well. Got my um, Chanel 19, Chanel AirPod case holder, and just usual suspects in terms of jewelry. But traveling comfortable with the family today, and this is my look today's outfit of the day travel look comfortable casual and ivory yay all right so i wanted to share real quick how the outfit's gonna look with the blazer on so i'm literally just gonna have it over my shoulders i'll probably wear this as a crossbody or carry it this way or just put it in my um, Dior book toad because you guys know I travel with that. But yeah, this is my travel look. Love, love, love. Outfit of the day. Today's travel look, I am getting ready to go to New York for a day trip. I still have luggage because I'm going to do try and fit a quick shoot or two in. I'm going for a meeting, so I wanted to look, you know, somewhat professional but stylish. I'll probably take this off when I get to my meeting, um, but since I'm traveling right now and I need my earpods close, I have that. Got my Chanel 19. Um, did my hair this morning and added the ponytail. I think I'll wrap it around when I'm shooting, but for now we're just going to leave it down. So this cardigan is a cashmere blend from Banana Republic. I love it. Um, I'm probably going to wear it a bit more relaxed and just do one button so it can hang. Then under that we've got a Tacos turtleneck. I love these turtlenecks. And then this choker is Saint Laurent, Chanel, cost pants, and my Chanel loafers which we love got my glasses on because i haven't done any makeup yet i'll probably do makeup in the washing at the airport um but yeah other than that i think that's all i got just gonna keep the earrings simple this is the look travel outfit of the day Get a little bit more light so you guys can see all the details a bit better. 
There we go. I usually don't do a lot of black on black, but for the shoot, because I'm actually shooting this look too. <laughs> so I just try to maximize everything and just pack everything I need. So this is good. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. Today is the beginning of the week. A lot of work to catch up on. Um, errands, all of that fun stuff. Not going out to anywhere spectacular, but mommy duties and working. So, you know, I still wanted to look cute. I wanted to be very comfortable today. So I'm wearing this crop t-shirt from Reebok. I did do a collaboration with Reebok and, and DSW. Um, so that's how I got this t-shirt and I love it. It's from DSW, of course, I'll link everything. But it's just really fun, it's very comfortable and casual. The sleeves are a little long on this, but I scrunched up the sleeves a little bit just to kind of, you know, show off my arm candy a little bit and give a more polished look with the t-shirt because it's very casual. My jeans are my Margella in the ivory. I just feel like I haven't worn them enough, so I just wanted to, you know, wear something fun, bottom-wise. And because the t-shirt is a crop and that you have the higher waist, it just really frames my waist really well and makes my waist look a lot smaller, so I love that. Shoes, I brought out these bad boys again. It's been a minute. My J.W. Anderson, I really need to get these in another color. I've been seeing this forever, but they are truly my go-to. They're comfortable. They add interest with the gold and I love them. They do come in other colors, so I, I think this will definitely be the season that I pick up another color just because I love them. Um, bag. Going to do my Balenciaga mini city bag. I love this bag. It's just such a good bag, and it looks great with everything. I think I'm just going to carry it. Well, I've been out already, and I've been carrying it has a top handle, so I think I'm just going to keep it that way and not put the strap on. The strap is on the bag in case I want it that way, but for the most part, because the outfit is so casual, carrying it as a top handle makes it a little dressier. Um, I need sunglasses and a perfume, and then we're done. One moment, please. Okay, uh, let's do let's do Joe Malone. I feel like I haven't done this in a minute, so we're gonna, this is going to be the scent of the day. This is a good one. And then sunglasses. We've got the Dior Aviators. I'm obsessed with this pair. I've worn them so much since I got them. Um, and they're everything. They just look super cool and they do a great job of complimenting this look. And this is the full look. Outfit of the day. I did my hair in this little top bun with the braid thing for a photo shoot that I did the other day. And um, I'm going to keep it in for one more day and then take it out. But it's really fun. But anywho, this is my look. Casual, cool, stylish, comfortable, easy to wear. Outfit of the day. Welcome to a very quick outfit of the day. I am taking my sister to get her nails done and then we are running errands. So, and I'm actually shooting this skirt too. So I decided to let me make it casual Then I'm gonna change and shoot it later. But I'm wearing my no jeans cardigan. I love it. This skirt was gifted to me by Shop Marjo. It's a black owned brand. I love it. I saw the designer wearing it and I just had to have it. My bodysuit is Skims. Loafers are Prada. And then bag, I'll be carrying my Dior book tote because um, I have to get some work done in the car. So yeah, this is a look very quick outfit of the day. Sorry guys. Outfit of the day. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another outfit another day so today's a little weird it is it was really cold in the morning but it's kind of warmish now that it's the afternoon it's kind of late afternoon I've ran a, a few errands already and I was just like this outfit's really cute let me share it um so I'm sharing today's look I did something a little different with my hair. I still have it in a, a bun, but the bun is a little higher and I have a little parting on the side. So I did that fun stuff, but I'm keeping it very simple with makeup. 
Um, the sweater really is the focus. I love the sweater. It's kind of old. I shared it with you guys last year. I got it last year. Um, and it's just really fun. It's in that beautiful lilac color, so love that. So that's really the focal point of this look. And then I paired the sweater with my um, Prada shorts. I know it's cold outside. I still wear shorts in the fall because it's not super cold yet. Um, and in my head, it's like wearing a mini skirt or wearing a, you know, wearing a skirt. But I prefer shorts because I feel like they're kind of warmer than a skirt. And when it does get a little cooler, I can always wear tights and then just throw on a longer coat. I actually ordered some really good coats. Oh my god, I can't wait to share that with you guys. Anywho, but yes, back to this look, wearing my Prada shorts. I love these. I'm definitely getting my cost per wear because I wear them all the time. All the time. I love them. I highly recommend if you want a fabulous pair of shorts that will literally last forever because this techno fabric, that's what they used to call it back in the day, um, techno, whatever, but now I think they just call it the nylon, but like I have, well, I think I got rid of my last like first Prada whatever stuff like years ago, like I had a piece that I had for years. And then I still have my Prada sports boots that have lasted for years. So Prada just makes good stuff. Um, so I intend to have these for a long time because they're just simple. But you can dress them up, dress them up. So it's justified. Like, you can justify that. I think it's $1,000 now. Someone's calling me. One moment, please. Sorry about that. So Prada shorts. We're doing Prada um, loafers as well. I think I want to get the pointy option of these if they're still available because I really like these. These are my go-tos. Um, so I'm definitely a loafer girl. So I find myself picking these up to wear them all the time. Then for a bag, I am doing my um, Brandon Blackwood bag. I don't wear this bag enough, but it's such a pretty bag. It's such a great bag. So I really need to try and wear it more. The bag itself is more of that purplish, which pairs perfectly with this lilac sweater. You also have the silver hardware, pairs perfectly with the silver hardware on my loafers. And then for sunglasses, adding more Prada to the mix. This pair has purple on the side, which I love, but then blue in front. So it just adds a little bit more interest. I love that. So yeah, this is the look, very simple. Today was just one of those days where I have to run a lot of errands, picking up the kids. Um, I'm at work, I'm at work, I'm at home, well, technically I'm at home at work. So working from home for pretty much um, a good amount of the day as well. And just had to shoot some beauty content um, for my other social media channels. So yeah, this is the look, this is my vibe today. Today's one of those days where I don't feel my best. So I love this sweater because it's very pretty. So kind of using my clothes to kind of lift my spirits up a little bit because we all have these days where you plan, plan, plan. Like I literally try to plan every minute of my day so I can utilize my time best. But even with all my planning, it was like one thing after the other, after the other that just went wrong. And I literally had a moment of just like tears, like what is up? But at the same time, I had to like pull myself out of that and remind myself that when things don't go the way you plan them to go, you have to like stop and take those moments as teachable moments. Like, how do I improve myself? Like, where did I go wrong? Maybe that, or just, it's okay. Like breathe, like things are not always going to happen the way you expect them to happen. So that's kind of still what I'm trying to walk myself mentally through that. And hopefully this will help anyone else who's having one of those days where, you know, you want to just dress up to make yourself feel better. Cause like I've been up since 545 working since then and just doing one thing, even my personal stuff outside of work went wrong. <laughs> but I guess that was my sign to just breathe and it's okay. So I'm learning, I'm learning. Anywho, this is my outfit with a little bit of life, <laughs> life tips for you as well as for myself because you know we need to re reinforce these affirmations of positivity and growth and to be still and self-care and all of that. But anywho, this is the look, outfit of the day. Yes, outfit of the day, we love. Oh, I forgot my perfume. I use, this is what I use today. This is a good one. Um, I picked this up when I was in Toronto and I love this scent, it's so good. Like, but it's just, you know, there's a mood to it. So I like it and it's kind of unisex. My husband uses it as well. So that was, this is what I'm using. 
And like I said, I will link everything. And this is my look. Thank you guys. <laughs> guys what's up welcome to another day another outfit had to use my cell phone today because i broke my camera <laughs> i'm not gonna get into it because that's gonna probably make me a little upset um but it's all good i have to order a new one i was supposed to do that this morning but my day just got really busy so i forgot to order a new one but yeah i broke my camera i do have another one like a standby one which is my canon but that one was falling apart and um yeah i'm sure it's dead anywho the outfit was really cute it's the end of the day i'm so tired i got up at like 3 a.m i've been up since 3 a.m and just couldn't sleep for hours and i'm exhausted um, so my eyes are literally hurting. I was still working, but I was just like, you know what? I have to stop working. I have to go upstairs and just retire or at least take a break before I finish. Um, and I was going to change and just, you know, put them, put on my lounge clothes. And I realized I was like, I haven't done the outfit of the day. And this look is pretty cool. Anywho, I'm going to break down the look real quick and then I will rest my eyes. So first of all, this very cool denim jacket is super old. It is from... Who is it from? Oh gosh. You know what? Now I actually spot the lint on my mirror. So I'm going to clean the mirror. One moment, please. <laughs> there we go. That's much better. Anywho, this denim jacket is very, very old. It was gifted to me by Sink, Sink the Set, Sink a Set, um, which is a, a fabulous brand. Um, so it's super old. I know it's not available. Then under that, I'm wearing my Skims bodysuit. I've got my waist trainer under it, but I was pretty much home for most of the day and just ran a few errands. Um, so the jacket kind of really covered it when I did have to get out of the car. Um, but just, I love this bodysuit. It's just easy. It works great with everything. And then I'm wearing these faux leather joggers from Spanx. The brand gifted it to me a long time ago, but I think this is like a classic for them. So they always kind of have it. My trusty J.W. Anderson slides that I'm obsessed with. We've got the Chanel AirPod case holder. Still have my hair in a nice slick back, but I'm going to take it out and probably just redo it um, in the morning and just let water get on it and just put it back in the ponytail. Arm candy, all the usual suspects. Um, style tip for this i'm wearing various shades of black if you didn't notice the jacket black but because you've got all the detail on it it kind of works there's a the silver there's the red you know there's the gold writing so it's just a really fun jacket which makes it really easy to add different elements and other pops of color which i will share in my sunglasses and the black of the skims is very different from the black of that. But it, this is still your, you know, all black look, but it's with interest. So it's fun. So if you are one that you love to wear all black, you're not necessarily a color person. This is a fun way to do all black, right? Whereby, because the materials are not, uh, are not the same, they're all different, it still works. So you've got the faux leather pants, you've got the denim, and then you've got the spandex with this and I'm breaking it up also with little accessories and then you also have the shoes that have the gold detail so this is a fun look I really really love the look I did also roll up the sleeves I kind of just let me come closer I just opened it up and kind of just did like um a very carefree fold so it can kind of just fall as it goes but the arm candy is showing and that was the idea with that kind of fold for a bag actually I'll do the sunglasses first so sunglasses rocking my Loewe's, I love them. They're fun, very fun to wear. Adds a pop of color. I think the yeah the writing on this is gold, so it pairs well with the little gold detail as well as the gold um little sun thingy, majingi going on there. <laughs> and then what else did I do? And then for bag, I just did my um Balenciaga mini city bag. I'm finding this is probably my most used bag lately. Like this is the one that I keep on picking up because it just works well with everything. And look how cool it looks with the outfit. Like, I am completely obsessed with this look. It is super casual. It is super comfortable, but stylish. So, you know, if you feel like, well, I wanna be comfortable, I don't, you can still be very stylish and be very comfortable. You just have to put the right pieces together. And I think this outfit is a perfect example of that. All right, outfit of the day. <laughs>
Hey guys, welcome to another day, another outfit. Um, I had to bring out my old Canon because I broke my other camera. Um, this one, it's still fine and it records well. I just, the, the screen, I had to use tape to glue it together. <laughs> but anywho, hopefully it'll hold me over until I get another, um, Sony. But yes, today's look, first of all, I think the star of this look are these pants. They're from Banana Republic. You guys have seen these in recent hauls. I'm obsessed with them, like completely obsessed. Then this shirt is also from Banana Republic. I got it on sale. Um, it's kind of a crop shirt, but what I did was I kind of tied the front and then just tucked it in to kind of show off the high rise of the pants and to just allow the shirt to frame um, my waist better and just make my waist look a little smaller and then under this I'm wearing a bodysuit it's a short sleeve bodysuit from Lady Boutique and then I've got another bodysuit from Skims under there um, I'm not wearing my waist trainer today because I'm wearing Skims like um, control tummy thing I'm gonna see if it does the same thing my waist trainer does but it's definitely giving me a smaller waist and I love that um, and it's nice and firm. So, and then my bodysuit is kind of helping keeping it in place so it doesn't roll down. I did notice that the Skims bodysuit has the tendency to roll, or, or the brief thingy that I'm wearing, it does have the tendency to roll down, but the bodysuit's kind of holding it in place. So, I love that. Then, shoes, I am doing my brown J. Crew loafers. I just picked these up. I love them. It's a beautiful chocolate brown, classic loafer, obsessed with. Um, sunglasses to complement the brown on my feet. I'm doing these brown key sunglasses. I love them. For those of you who follow me on Instagram, you saw that I did a key collaboration, and this is one of the pairs that I picked. They are so cool. Like, I'm obsessed. Obsessed. Um, bag, I'm doing something a little different. I'm adding this pop of orange. Orange looks good with all these colors, with the yellow, with the brown, and the beige. Um, and this is the look. Oh, we gotta do perfume first. I'm gonna show you the perfume that I'm wearing today. Sorry about that, my battery died, but using um, Alien from Mugler, Mugler. I did a little giveaway on my website with one of these perfumes, so I love the smell. This is kind of the scent I'm going for today. I'm trying to discover what my signature scent is gonna be, so I might do something on Instagram and just try trying to figure out my signature scent. I feel like I'm getting more and more into perfumes now, so I might need to solicitate your guys' help on that. But anywho, this is the full look. I'm kind of obsessed with today's look. It's casual, cool, it's fun. Easy breezy, love it. Um, I did add a little bit more to the arm candy. Did the brought out my Hermes bracelet today, and then everything else is pretty much usual suspects. David Yerman, um, what's it called? Rolex and Ipolita bracelets, and then I added my Dior cuff here. So I really wanted to roll up the sleeves as well to make sure um, the arm candy was showing. And then I told you guys what I did with the tuck in. And yeah, keeping it simple fun it's cold but not super cold so I don't even think I'll need even a shawl like I can literally go out like this because I'm I'm trying to trying to go to the mall real quick to pick up something and then that's it just mommy errands I'm gonna end my work day early um, but yeah this is the look comfortable casual fun outfit of the day Hey guys, welcome to a very quick outfit of the day. I am taking my kids to watch a movie. Um, so I'm wearing my Skims bodysuit. And then we've got this fun no jeans um, cardigan, which I'm obsessed with. The pants are Frankie Shop. We love them, very comfortable. I decided to wear my Prada rubber jellies because we're gonna be doing some walking around and I want it to be very comfortable. Then I also have my yellow Fendi peekaboo to kind of just pick off of the yellow in the cardigan. And then we're also doing the yellow Lueves. And that's the look. Sorry guys, I can't even think of any um, outfit tips right now because I'm in a rush. But the look was really fun, it's colorful. This is a great way 
to introduce color into your fall outfit with a cardigan, with your accessories, fun shoes. And yeah, this is my look. Outfit of the day. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. Um, the weather in Atlanta is kind of messed up. One minute it's cold, the next minute it's hot. So today I think it's kind of like mid 70s. So, and this is why I'm struggling because I haven't put my summer clothes away. I've only taken out things that I know I'm not gonna wear again and I've been giving away. But I know I need to take more things out and I don't have space for my <laughs> for my fall clothes. I literally have bags of clothes, like my folded sweaters, and I just have nowhere to put them because the weather is so up and down. Um, so at least I'm still getting to utilize everything and I'm trying to mix and match a little bit of fall, a little bit of, you know, to create perfect fall looks. But, you know, the weather, is, it is what it is, but today is one of those days where... I've, it's a Monday, so I've got a lot of work to do. It's the beginning of the week. Um, I also have to run a few errands, mommy duties. My husband's out of town, so mommy and daddy duties, literally. Um, so I want it to be comfortable. I want it to be fun. I want it to be ready for the week. So this tank top, which I love, you guys have probably seen it before many times, I feel. It's from Banana Republic. I, think, I do believe they still have it. Of course, I will link it. Blazer super old from Zara, not available, but I'm sure Zara might have something similar. If I find something similar, I will also link that. My tailored shorts, which I absolutely love. I love the detail, the fabric on them. are The fabric's amazing. It's a really nice cotton, but it's nice and thick, so it's very substantial. The shorts are from Toast in New York. I will link them. I think that they're a great price point considering the level of detail, the fit, and all of that, so I'm obsessed. Um, shoes, we are doing my Chanel loafers, just a classic loafer, you can't go wrong. And I feel like the loafers do a great job of just complementing the vibe of this look. It's clean, chic, not too fussy, um, very simple but very stylish and of course elevated which is what we go for on a regular. Um, my watch, Michelle Black Diamonds, I feel like I haven't worn this watch enough. So I'm trying to make sure I wear it whenever I can. But I feel like whenever I wear it, it's not in focus yet. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to get it in focus. Let's just look at it from here. <laughs> but yes, um, I'm def I, I feel like when I wear it, I don't wear other pieces just because the black just stands out. And it, to me, it's the statement. Um, but keeping it simple, no makeup kind of day, just my studs to complement the top bun, rings, all the uh, usual suspects. So now we just need bag and sunglasses. Oh, I almost forgot today's scent. Um, I'm still trying to find my signature scent. What scents are you guys like obsessed with? Um, please suggest. I, I, I feel like I've said this before. I've never bought perfume. I've only really used perfumes that were gifted to me by brands or gifts from friends. This I picked on my own, which is the Gentle Fluidity. What It was gifted to me by the brand and I really like it. And that's the scent for today. It's just, it's Gentle Fluidity Silver. And I think it's just nice and fresh. It's a great um, fragrance, and I love that. But I'm I'm still trying to get more into perfumes. Um, I didn't realize like people were like so into perfumes because I've done a few perfume giveaways on my website for my subscribers. So if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. But now I'm just realizing how much people love perfumes and are into perfumes, and I'm trying to get into it too. But I I think I just I'm trying to figure out what scent is best for me. I know what I like to smell. I like airy. I like fresh. I don't like anything that's too harsh. And this is, I like this because I feel like that's what this gives me. Um, I don't know all the notes and all of that stuff and all the, the jargon or how to describe scents and notes, but I, I have an idea of what I like. So hopefully I can figure out how to describe it properly. So I feel like that way, you know, we can all discover fun scents together. Anywho, that's what I'm wearing. Sunglasses, we're doing Dior today. I feel like I don't wear these enough, so I love these. I love the slight gold detail. I feel like it does a great job of complementing the 
brush gold detail on my loafers and they're you know they're edgy they're fun they complement the overall look especially with the lines if you're new here I use little details to pull things and to pair things I either use color or details and little details like this just in my opinion just work because you've got those lines going through you've got the lines on the the tank top as well okay I feel like when I put my glasses on it, it goes it goes darker not that I feel it actually does. Bag, we're doing my Fendi peekaboo. I see you. <laughs> I haven't said that in a minute because I haven't carried the bag in a minute. Um, and this is why I keep on saying this is why I'm kind of like slowing down on bags and buying bags because I want to use the bags I have. They're so fun and I love them all. Um, so I just need to I need to push myself to use them more because I find that when I get a new one I just use that one and then I forget about everything else so I just need to push myself to use them more and I do I have one bag coming but I'm eyeing another bag for the holidays which I think I might pick up we'll see um, but I'll keep you guys posted but anywho how fabulous actually even the glasses on my head and you're not supposed to wear your glasses like this but whatever it is what it is but the bag very chic classic complements the overall look because we're giving chic carefree vibes with today's outfit I really love this fit like I'm gonna be home for most of the day working but you know when we step out we got to step out right so but yeah this is the look the glasses the perfume the whole vibe we love, we love, we love today's outfit of the day. Don't forget to let me know which outfit is your favorite. If you're feeling this outfit, give me a thumbs up and say yes, black and white. Or maybe like, yeah, a black and white heart. Like black heart, white heart, black heart, white <laughs> Whatever you guys want to do, I appreciate it all. But anywho, I'm clearly I'm really feeling this look. I feel like this outfit of the day 31 is going to be like one of my best because I just, I love all the looks. All right, bye guys. After the day. All right, guys, there you have it. Those are my outfits, those were my looks. Which outfit was your favorite? Which style tip was your favorite? Let me know with your comments below. As always, thank you so much for tuning in. If you are not following, if you are, if you are not following me on Instagram and TikTok, make sure you check me out. It's Odd by Moni on both platforms. Check out my website, oddbymonica.com. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. Happy November. Oh yeah. It's my anniversary month. Yay. <laughs> Bye, guys.